ground, Burgoyne gives it off here. Here's a chance now for Rory Lee. Oh! Oh! Have a look at that at the Adelaide oh! Oval. Here he goes again with that uh, inside out oh! kick and over the top. Nile Morgan. Oh! Forward is good too. Found some space in. Oh! Goes forward too. That's a goal. That is a magnificent effort by Michael Murphy, that man. Absolutely outstanding, the handball coming from oh, Pierce Hadley. Just trying to scoop it up, but coming the other way, brilliantly done by Zach Tui. Takes them on, Ryder was right there and got the other way, Cadigan. Got it away, just taken by Murphy. Oh. Terrific tackle, Merritt. Feels like a really dangerous stage of the game for the Irish. They're running well, their confidence is up. Burgoyne, brilliant to Betts, back to Burgoyne. Fife, who has start, does he go to the... Oh! Nat Fife finds the back of the net for a strike. From just about anywhere. Woody, look at his confidence, Ty. What yeah, do you reckon? The minute he's marked, he's the guy, you know what, I'm going to have a crack at this. And he certainly has the ability to score this. From a long way out, from 45, has he got it on it? Oh, oh. Just outstanding kick, isn't it? Running hard from the 45. Dangerous ball into the oh. area. And the goal is scored by Shuey. Back of the net, a six-pointer. They're going to be hard. The smear to set it up. It's a dangerous ball inside. Well done. O'Shea gave it to Brennan. Back of the net. Ireland get the great start. Dusseri, it's a good ball. And on the lead, here's the man that can cause some damage in Murphy. Over the top, Brennan again. Two goals in the space of a minute. This time it's Barrett. And they've struck and put the Australians on the back foot. Ball from behind. Barrett at the spill. It's back towards O'Shea, shut down immediately. The Irish in the last line. Barrett in trouble and will be penalised. First, Walsh, he's a chance. Hughes, oh, oh. God, outstanding. And got up. Was it what? You know, Mark Schwarzer, we're talking about him pre game and his ability, Brenda got up. Just a hand eye to actually get a hand to that. Heads in board, looking for Smith. It was a late hit by Selwood, which will be penalised. Hitting the deck was Barrett, and now the Irishman comes to vent their spleen. He, he probably not the players just weren't ready for it. We see a bit of registration going on in the ground right now between Murphy and it, this can't yeah. continue in the misunderstanding. This is really bubbling over now. This is fierce, ferocious stuff. The Australians and the Irish. Well, this is exactly what both organisations didn't want. These ugly melees, which really do the series reputation no good. Across to Shuey. Has to dispose of it. A couple of bounces. To the goal mount. Morgan. Full frontal attack on the ball. It's well on the money. Didn't Wingard cop a big hit and got straight to his feet after it. Great take by the goalkeeper. That was a really tough kick. That one to really set the forward up. So worth pointing out. 14 points to one. Oh, five. What a fly. We'll see not a quarter of it. Murphy. Across to Walsh. Goal scoring situation, got out again! Outstanding! And here he is, the scorer, McManus. Not from there, surely not! Oh, wonderful! Zorko. Can they get their first goal of the evening? After a bounce, he settles for the over and does just that. Runs onto the ball, runs towards the 21, now the 13. Brilliant save by the Irishman, Morgan. Cut down by Wingard. Zorko, clever, off the ground. Taps it back to himself, off the left, and perhaps it is over and out for the Irish. Dane Zorko celebrates accordingly. Oh, it's great ball. First Connor McMahon is into the middle, catches off his line. There's a chance of a goal! <laughs> Ireland have scored sensationally. It's big. Aidan O'Shea from County Mayo has scored a cracking goal for his country. Tackle is fine. Australia have a chance. It's one against one. Oh, now Morgan. Brilliant save. Here comes Aidan O'Shea. Bernard Brogan available. He's dead. Oh, great save by Fletcher. Comes back to O'Shea. What can he do? He can score. It's one here. Beautifully knocked down. There's a chance here for Ireland. Bernard Brogan. Oh, the pass was a bit high, but it's in the net. Despite the collision with the post, the pass was a poor one. But uh, was he inside that small rectangle? That's what they're protesting about, the uh, Australians. Decision seems to be a penalty. 
which is going to be taken by Conor McManus, taking on Dustin Fletcher. It's Clontibret Monaghan against Essendon. Ireland versus Australia. Ireland. Matty Donnell again has impressed with his work rate. This time the. Uh, That's a big tackle from Paddy Dangerfield. Forward where a hand pass probably would have been a better option, but it's still there for Andrew Gaff. And Andrew drops it in. The goalkeeper has to come off his line, but the ball is in the net. And Ireland concede play to Peter Hart. Ireland have to have this opportunity as Paul Kerrigan. It's Bernard Brogan taken down. And the referee. That's a good tackle. Trying to break the tackle. Gets the handball away. Brilliant look away. Harvey's kick smothered. Goes again. Did it go over? It was a brilliant save by the keeper. Paddy O'Rourke saving a certain six-pointer. Retreats to the goalkeeper who will need to go with a long kick and he thumps it to halfway. Revolt to run onto it. And oh. mark. <laughs> How many times have we seen that in AFL football? His massive work rate, but he's just outrunning his opponent. Brilliant reading by Chad Wingard. I wonder if he'll take him on here. Will he go for the six? The little kick to himself. Six-pointer, no. On the line, was it saved? Oh. High tackle against Revolt. Nick Revolt didn't like it. He sends it high. The keeper did well. Paddy O'Rourke under it. Clear away. 20 metres, 20 metres. Come this way. Hold side. This third term. We've only gone five minutes. They've been electrifying. Mitchell's up to 18. Hodge to 17. Now a chance for Ireland. Ball comes inside. Hughes for six points. The first six pointer of the night. He can use the runner outside. Opportunity for Donnelly. Goes for the over. Another one. And an off the ground. That was very clever. Well done, Munnelly. Now the high ball's in. The pressure again. Has it got too much? It's an over. Oh, magnificent kick from McKernan. And that advantage taken very quickly. Hughes bursts away. They know they haven't got a lot of time. Downfield is the call. Advantage allowed. Ball inside. The skipper Murphy misses. Brilliant save. A kick coming. They score. So how long have we got to go? Maybe five minutes remaining. Ball into a dangerous position again. Brilliantly done, Fletcher. Come out. 20 metres. 20 metres. Mark paid. They cough it up. They do. Hanley, well done. Begley, ball across. Brilliantly done by Fletcher. Brilliant by Fletcher, the match winning move. opening quarter, Lee Keegan back in again, Walsh, and here's a goal chance to Kavanagh, stopped by Ash McGrath, really good goal chance, that was the best goal chance of the match so far, Chrissy McCaig, as far as Aidan Walsh, bounces it once, about to be challenged here strongly by Sean Edwards, treading it in here beautifully, it's Conroy from Galway and Ireland, back in again it comes, great run through the centre, what a goal that is! Brilliantly, the angle's tight. Here's a goal chance, and there's a goal for Australia. Brilliantly done. Jake Need has just come off the bench in the last couple of minutes. Irish defence and a strong challenge on the goalkeeper. Eddie Betts in the thick of it. Betts here, sets it up. Oh, comes back somehow. Missed opportunity. Well, this is an up and Adam, a real searching ball in here. The Australians went up high. McLaughlin finishes. Week, well, we, we didn't go down by a lot more points, so he's, a, he's been fantastic in the goals for us. Back come Australia again, Sheringham this time, Wellingham this time, and a big, huge one, over. but it's, uh, has it dropped over? It has. It's a three-pointer, quickly now, and McKeever kicks it in for Ireland to a two-man inside forward line, Murphy trying to break it down, succeeds, and there's a goal by Conor McManus. The ball was so easily to move through the middle of the ground there, a couple of forward hand passes, and that nice long kick into the forward line really puts it Defenders under. He feeds it in beautifully. McManus again and finished to the back of the net once more. 
but this guy's quick movement and his movement of thought as well to get into good positions very evident one thing i've really noticed from the irish guys is just how well they do the football use by your players able to hit the targets quite comfortably under pressure Munnerly again free in as far as Kavanaugh. Kavanaugh right on the baseline, oh! keeps it in here, and another one is stuck in. From side, but Ireland are coming again. Burns there, and they fist it into the empty net, and again it's Connor McManus. Well created, and they're back again, Ireland, and they get another one, and it's put in the back of the net by Mark Priority. Possible opportunity here. Hill looks around, have a go, bets, bets. And it's in there eventually. Eddie Betts around there by Leroy Jetta. Jetta feeds it on there to Lindsay Thomas. Back into it comes Davey. Back once again is Jake Need. He's got another one. There's no stopping Jake Need. Connor McManus has been outstanding in that. Back once again, this time to Paul Conroy. The uh, Galway player playing it in. I don't know if anybody got a final touch to it. Whether or not it was touched on its way in here Sackling backs himself does Whoa. the spoiling he might pay the price here the kick over the top is a goal a goal Quite do you think oh, the fitness level of the Australians will kick help? in yeah. yes no oh, doubt about that. high tackle there by uh, Eamon in fact it was Kieran Donaghy help Cluxton then use him as the go-to player the distributor if you like oh, it's up, here we here's go. a big chance Ten. screen yes. those famous soccer skills oh, oh. maybe that'll lift it yeah what a work, high ball, plenty of tall timber there, Donna. He couldn't go. Oh, what a clash! Bolton on the end of it. Mitch Robinson, as we know, is prepared to throw himself sometimes recklessly anywhere. Oh, I think he's attacking the ball there. Mitch had eyes for the ball and went desperately for it. It's just accident as I could see that. But uh, he's had a heavy knock. There's a bit Ooh, of uh, argy bargy here. Oh, oh, this is what we don't want to see. And here we go. This is not what we wanted to see, and it is on. Australia and Ireland erupting again. Hopefully, cool heads will prevail and they will be separated by the umpires. We don't want to see this. Brendan Murphy, who spent a couple of years. In Australia, at the Swans, he is mm. for casual brilliance. Riley's chipping ball is mm. superb. Glean back mm. into the back of the net. There was I mean, Parsons. That's been his uh, Achilles' heel at the moment in this match. Anyway, he hasn't kicked well at all. As we get down to you, Ricky, you've got Lee Montagna with you, mate. That's right, Bruce. Oh. Lee, do you feel like the momentum change? Oh, yeah, no doubt. The boys are starting to really get on top now. We knew a three-quarter time, our fitness will probably tell in the end, so... He's been booked. We can't let the breeze do it for us, we're to keep running, keep working, but we're confident we can run over it. And the crowd have really got involved, haven't they? Yeah, it's unbelievable, it's really, uh, okay. really amazing to have the whole crowd on our side, and it's, um, yeah, it's really exciting. They've been in there initially, and they've got the numbers. Eventually, it comes back, and lead, oh. in front on, down he goes, and Australia may have decided enough, is it now? Oh, that one. That's like, that's silly. He wanted to call him Edna. Just gone up a uh, notch, hasn't it? And you can see here, bang in the back in that attempt, which was basically after the siren. And it's still going on here. Josh Canny here is wanting to take it to another level. And it erupts again. Little spot fires everywhere here at the moment. O'Shea with some jumperies. Boy, cockatoos in there. And this has erupted at quarter time at Adelaide Oval. And the umpires are having trouble controlling this one. A lot of feeling in this one. Oh, it's on again. And it's on again at ground level. You know, Here they go. Ruggles. Boy, look at him go here. Gregson's throwing a couple. Trimgo's gone in. All the heavies are there. Right near the supporters. And the umpires are having trouble controlling this one. Here we come, please. Here we come, please. Dangerfield already with his coach and Selwood. As finally, a minute and a half after the siren sounded, they go their separate ways. Stay with us. You feel some repercussions coming on the other side of the break. Look at Chris Scott and Hartlett. 
they're going at it. That's what the report was for. That's it. That's it. And Viney, well, might be in a little bit of trouble himself with the square up, but gee, that was uncharacteristic and quite a vicious act, wasn't it? Uh, it is. Look, it's a, it's a week. That's a week, and like I said, that's just pure frustration of a man that gives his. It gives it gives everything. It's totally out of character. It isn't it have lifted a little bit in that area. Levi. Kick kick incident. Levi, settle. I'm reporting you for striking. I'm reporting you for striking. So uh, Greenwood on report. I'm reporting for striking. Just have a look here. Throws a Yours. punch to the stomach unnecessary. He's had a goal again. He needs to build towards that two or three goal again point where he's got that real consistency. Chalor to side bottom as Collingwood dig it out of the middle. Kick floats inside the forward 50. Bagley comes up. 